This day did not start well for me. I couldn't wake up when I wanted, so I slept longer than I intended to. And then I had like the sleep paralysis, which is called, like when you're aware but you can't wake up. Ugh. Just stepped out to go to the dentist and I noticed something's going on out here. There was a helicopter circulating before. I got a dentist appointment in about six minutes and I'm about to be late. Japan is a very punctual country, so I really hate being late. Nobody's here. Japan has national health insurance, which is awesome, especially for me as an American. Medical attention here is a bit different than in the US. For example, here doctors are really well respected, so it's very rare for patients to question them. Um, whereas in the US, I'm used to asking my doctor a lot of questions, um, finding out more about what's going on. And just to avoid the language barrier, of course, I'm much more com comfortable with English-speaking doctors, especially if they studied in the US. With the English-speaking doctors, a lot of them service the expat community and therefore not all of them are on the national health insurance so when you do find one that is it's it's like gold this astro boy here is a piece by invader one of the most famous street art artists in the world there she is good morning uh, good, good afternoon. afternoon. <laughs> nice shirt. Thanks. We've officially been vlogging for over a week now and it seems that the prerequisite for continuous vlogging is a penny board. So we're checking out what that means. I don't expect to be rocking the world with a skateboard. It screams midlife crisis, come on. No, midlife crisis is a little later. The funny thing is, in Tokyo, you sh you're not really supposed to skateboard on the street, so it's pretty much I pointless. I we think. Yeah. I'm not uh, 100% sure. I've learned how to carry the skateboard. You're too cool to hang out with me now. Well, it's been fun hanging out with my skater buddy here, but I gotta go. Bye. See ya. So I'm up to see my friend Martina now, who's a Polish girl, and she's gonna have a baby soon. So it's like five hours after I left for the dentist, and there's still police hanging up around here. I still have no idea what the deal is with all this police. This company wins with their packaging. Cute and clever. So that's my moisturizer and I got a, a highlighter. So there was someone who commented and asked about cosmetics and I said that I would wait for a friend to do the video because I don't know much about cosmetics. And it's true, but when I do buy cosmetics in Japan, I usually buy Korean cosmetics um, because they seem to be a bit more English, fr English friendly. Usually there's English written on them. And um, it's important because a lot of cosmetics in Asia have whitening agents in them and I really don't want whitening cosmetics so um, I seem to have it figured out for the Korean cosmetics but not the Japanese ones. Alright, time to finish off the penny board. Alright, it's good. The camera's better at riding the skateboard than either of us are. Takotamagawa, that's what this area is called. I have no idea what's here. I've never been here and, and I've never heard about it. Martina's been in Japan a bit longer than I did. And also she used to be a tour guide of Tokyo. So she knows some really in-depth, amazing spots. Mm. Had some good Japanese food and now I'm grabbing a tour of the area from Martina who's the type of person who said oh you're making daily videos now so come on I'll show you some good shit 
bow ties for dogs. I wouldn't buy this for my dog. Oh, these are called doggles. That's smart. So these are shrimp in a jar that you can have as pets in your house. It's convenient. Twenty million yen for a, is it a phone. It's a phone. All right. <laughs> What the hell is that? This is the first time in Japan I see a Polish magazine. This is a powder room for uh, babies and it has lamps shaped as the moments. Pretty sweet. This area turns out to be very popular for couples with children. Which is interesting because in central Tokyo you don't see many couples with children. Turns out they all live here. There's a lot of really amazing architecture. Overall a pretty cool area that I wouldn't have known from any other source than what they know. Bye bye! I got this for Kasia. The magical Eggman told me to give you this. Uh, thank you. It's like meant for the bartending hamster. That's my phone for even more context. Guess there's nothing else really to do with these but add them to the office Gudetama collection. And back to work. And the police is still here. So if anyone's watching the news and has any idea what's going on, let me know. I'm unnecessarily excited because it's very rare to see something like this happen in Japan. Let's see if we can find out what's going on around here. Nothing yet. Bartizek 100. Stół z powłamywanymi nogami and szczęść brzmi w szczynie. W szczynie. That's the harder one. W szczynie? W szczynie. W szczynie. W szczynie. Szczęść brzmi w szczynie. Yeah? I don't know.